Um, police department just said you can see more views because they're voting me in a lot of the court cases. Um, yeah, I've never seen that many views on here. Um, way the court cases, they also modify my Facebook where I don't see all the, read all the comments. I can't see all the views and a lot of things they do to my Facebook to modify the, um, modify the, um, um, Facebook and my live videos for the court case. But even Drew Barrymore has came here, Oprah Winfrey came here. Drew Barrymore came here in disguise. Um, my friends, my children have made very good friends with her friends, her kids, um, and, um, she came here in disguise, but, um, this is the largest lawsuit in history, and I'm living homeless, when my husband, Officer Pelez, lives right down the road, and my son with autism that's illegally placed in foster care, and they're being neglected and abused, she's trying to figure out why I cannot see Tony. If we're going home with him, why can't I see Tony? If um, New York is here, New York Social Service is here in Tennessee and Georgia area, why can't they remove us? Um, if, 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 if I didn't abuse my kids like everything, <laughs> he's messaging, sorry, because like, I just got off the phone with him and the police department and the courts um, told me to do this video. Um, the way the court case is, it's gone on for 10 years and I've been electrocuted and everything in the court case. Um, I sat next on the bus yesterday to a woman who lived next to my sister, was part of having my children removed. Um, she hid clothes, she hid almost most of their clothes that we had and even Christmas presents that they received through harassing away charges because this court case is also about harassing away charges till the end of the court case. Um, she hid them at her house. They also were involved with drugging my kids. Um, my daughter Kayla almost, um, Toad almost died and so did I, especially her and I at um, my sister's house because she had us sleeping on the floor. And before that, um, she, um, she had us placed in, she had me placed in a mental institution right before I got to her house. There are a lot of things. Um, they were listed on the website, uh, what I've gone through over the years. And then even the police department's going to have to explain what I've gone through. Um, they have some things to say. And they want to talk about what's going on. And talk about this court case. It's not a joke. But um, it takes one person, the way the court case is that's being charged, to say no. I protest her getting out. I protest her going home to her children. I protest um, this court order, that court order, any court orders the police department is doing to the courts remove her from those court orders um, to remove me from any fraud. It's the largest fraud case and largest hate crime in U.S. history. Even the storage facility I'm in right now, they're being charged with um, holding me hostage in the court case. Um, social service, Georgia Social Service is being charged with, because of the foster parent, with holding um, my boys in the court case. I have five biological children. <laughs> I've never seen this many views. I usually see like three, um, but they're changing the court case. <laughs> I'm not used to this. Um, I'm trying not to look at the views. So <laughs> when the New York Times airs this, I'm sitting, sitting, doing a thing with uh, Drew Barrymore and Oprah Winfrey, and it's going to be a book and movie with Oprah Winfrey and Steven Spielberg. It's going to have a movie. But um, yeah, <laughs> uh, I, I want my kids to be the center of attention because I don't like this kind of stuff. Um, I also get paid to do these videos, but, um, I wanted to walk around and see if there's anybody hiding up here, but they have some things to say on the website and talk about what's going on and, um, talk about the court case, but, um, people have, the police department says nobody's in here, but I wanted to check myself. <laughs> I actually have the police department on my earbuds. My boys have earbuds too, put in their ears and but mine are a lot better. Mine are actually placed in my ears from the Secret Service. 
um, through the court case, untraditionally, I was also hired in um, by the police without me knowing. And then my that paycheck got harassed away. I've been living homeless for a long time to end this court case. Really, I'm legally brain dead. I'm cut to life through a chip and earbuds and drugs. And I'll talk about all that. And also, I have chips in me that cause pain. I went through just last night. Don't talk. I don't want to. <laughs> They'll talk about what I went through last night and show a video of people harassing me while I'm sleeping in the rain outside. And tonight it's going to rain all night and it's been raining all day. And it's been raining for the past few days and I go to sleep outside in the rain. Um, um, they want to talk about what's going on with the court case. And they are voting more. Yeah, I'm seeing 133 views. I like to do whenever I saw like one or two or three. But they're voting a lot in the court case. They always told me that more people look at the, these videos than when I knew that they looked at them. Um, and even people leave comments that I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry about your kids, it's sad, and we're praying for you, and stuff like that, but I don't actually see those. Those get removed from the court case. Also, the views got removed. Um, the New York Times is here, and they cannot air this because fraud said, um, not to air it. Um, the way the court case was, I was supposed to be left dead, um, to adopt out my kids. And um, the family wanted them, and, uh, and different people wanted the kids for kaching. Nothing but kaching. They were after the money. The adopt out the kids. Wait till the kids are old enough. Become best friends with the kids. Um, by the way, you know, we never talk to you. We're family, but, you know, never pals. Get them addicted to drugs, alcohol like us, and hey, we're doing good. <laughs> You got the money, I got the friends, we're all good. But my kids are never like that. They're not like that. They have some things to say on the website, and they won't talk about what's going on. Um, they're removing more and more fraud. They also do what they call fraud in my ear. It's like voices. And the police department says that's what's going on. I'll take their word on it because I'm hearing somebody in here. <laughs> and I'm up here by myself and it's after hours. But they'll talk about what I've gone through and show examples over the years. Um, it's unreal what I've had to sleep with and I can't do anything about it because it's on my earbuds. And the police department was telling me it wasn't on my earbuds and they were lying to me. I'm going to talk about that. Um, they were lying to me. They lied to my kids. Um, my son William is trying to figure out why he can't call the police department and talk to Tony who is going home with us, who wants to be his father. And who is legally all five of my children's father, plus we adopted two in the court case I've never got told. Why I can't, why he can't and I can't and Jacob can't call the police department and say, can you tell me about the court case? Um, because fraud said that, um, something about frauds, the other side of the court case, the fraud part, said it takes one person to say no. The boys can't call, and the way the court case is, I'm supposed to air a lot what's going on. Um, also, fraud can say, I want her to buy this at Walmart, and the way the court case is, I'm legally brain dead. I will buy that at Walmart, um, because I'm actually told what to do. Um, they're drugs, and I don't know my own thoughts. I can't read a book. I can't read the Bible. Um, somebody gave me a Bible one time and I took it quite offensively because I can't read the Bible. Um, I'm lucky to be alive through this court case. I've had to work through hard work, work, go to work and they'll talk about it. Work as I'm having a heart attack and stroke. Work as I'm struggling to keep my lungs going. And I know it. No place for me telling me. It's part of the fraud. You're having this. Have a panic attack and give up. Um, sometimes I wonder why I don't have a panic attack and just have a full, just conk out. I can pass out and don't pass out. I can black out and it's like it, but I'm still walking. It's like I'm not there, but I'm still walking. 
and I don't totally know where I am, but I look conscious and I look awake. Um, it has to do with the chip that's in me. Um, this particular chip has never been placed in anyone. And, um, usually people that are leaving comments are being charged and um, you can ask about um, different people that leave comments because usually they're being charged. There's millions of people in this court case being charged. Um, even the, the country singer that married a cop, the New York cop, because this is originally a New York case, she's even being charged, and him, because she pulled him into it. Um, she was already going to be arrested. And um, police department has told me that's a little bit of a scam, you know, on this red wagon that married the country cop. I mean, the, the, um, the cop in New York. And, um, I'm having a hard time doing this because what they did last night, and I didn't get any sleep last night, so I'm having a hard time doing these videos. Um, I kind of liked it whenever I didn't have to do any. I'm going to look, even Molly Cyrus, I'm told, is going to be arrested in this court case. The way the court case is, also fraud wanted, before I was removed, they wanted laws to be changed if Congress wanted laws changed. Um, people auctioned off laws to be changed. And it's one court case, so one person speaks up for everybody. Um, they want to talk about what's going on and explain the court case. Um, I don't feel very good today, and my son is messaging me, and I'm sorry. <laughs> um, I've been away from my kids for a few years, so I want to talk to him. Maybe and say, hey, William, how are you doing? Hey, Jacob, how are you doing? So I'm going to let the police department finish off the rest. But um, this court case is open to the public. It's the largest fraud and hate crime. It was originally called the harassment and pain case. That's what the other side of the court case wanted it to be called. And I was always told it was going to be changing. And let's try to explain how I am told, I'm actually told what to say. And they'll explain that. And um, Officer Norton, Chad Norton, has some things to say. He's a cop for New York. Um, he, at the moment, he's working with the Secret Service. Um, he got hired in to the Secret Service, more into it, over this court case. <laughs> um, not, uh, because of the job that they did, they, a lot of them got promotions, even my, um, husband. Actually, we're legally married. <laughs> um, Vera Wang is doing the wedding, and Disney is, uh, um, we're gonna have the wedding at Disney, Disney World. But um, a lot of things are going to happen, and um, a lot of great things are going to happen for us for what we've gone through, and um, what people